So I picked up this used Airflow MSS tailgate stainless steel sander. Salt spreader, whatever you want to call it. See there, there's the, the mount to go into the your hitch receiver. And right now, I'm just trying to get it so that I can run it off my backhoe by hooking it up to the front bucket. In an emergency, I'm going to leave the uh, hitch receiver on there so that I can use it on the Land Rover if I need to, but ideally I'd like to run it off the uh, backhoe. So to do that, I picked up one of these uh, clamp-on trailer hitches. You can see here, it goes on the bucket just like that. So I'm going to unbox this, hook it up to my bucket, and see if we can get the sander on there. It took me a while, but uh, I was able to get it on. Kind of had to use the strap to uh, draw it into the, the hitch here. The strap there. Anyway, it's on. I'm gonna have to come up with a Quicker way though, that took too long to, uh, to do. And the way it works is it's uh, got this little conveyor down there that draws the sand or salt mix down to there and it drops it down on that spinning disc <laughs> uh, the previous owner put these on not exactly sure i think they're to keep uh, sand off the bearing Let's see there's the, the gearbox that runs the runs the uh conveyor belt as well as the spinner it goes up up to here and there you can see there's a chain drive that runs the spinner from the gearbox and the previous owner added this <laughs> that antenna and the flag there so you could see it from behind the truck it's actually quite handy so I can tell how far out in front uh, it is and the uh, previous owner also made this, this nice lid for it out of galvanized steel. And so I've got it, as you can see here, hooked up to the backhoe. And it's, uh, it's hooked up using this uh, hitch clamp. It goes on the front bucket. So I'm just about to uh, load it up with some sand salt mix and do the hill. I'll give you a close up here of it working. If it won't get too loud, I'll get it closer. See the conveyor there moving? That's how it brings the sand down in.
and I just have it wired up via a relay to a switch in the cab so I can turn it on and off. So I just put uh, eight bags, 20 kilogram bags. So that's, uh, uh, let's see, 352 pounds worth of sand in there. And it's just about full. You could probably fit another two in there. And uh, we'll see how far that goes on the road. What the? Oh, Craig got a new video. So glad I subscribed. <laughs>